Earlier, I referenced the tremendous amount of data generated each day. It has become a byproduct of modern life. For companies and organizations, all this data can provide insight into the ways they operate and ultimately interact with their users and consumers. To obtain these insights, organizations need people with the ability to access, interpret, and share the stories within their data. Organizations understand that data can inform decision-making and explain consumer trends and user behavior. Data professionals use data insights to optimize products or services. There's a common phrase in data-driven decision-making that references the untapped potential of data. The phrase is, imagine if we knew what we know. Basically, it's a way of asking the following question. How can we take all that data that may already exist and translate it into meaningful and actionable insights? To gain insights, businesses rely on data professionals to acquire, organize, and interpret data, which helps inform internal projects and processes. Businesses seek those who can access data and understand its metrics. As a reminder, metrics are methods and criteria used to evaluate data. Both are necessary before creating predictive models that can identify trends and inform best practices. And that's where you'll come in. The combination of all these skills, from statistics and scientific methods to data analysis and artificial intelligence, all fall within the category of data science. Data science is the discipline of making data useful. To me, the idea of usefulness is tightly coupled with influencing real-world actions. Some individuals with these skills may work on developing business insights and supporting strategic decision makers. Others may use data skills to fuel automation, testing, and analytic tool development. Still others may focus on the analytic process itself by adapting modeling approaches to incorporate new and emerging technologies. Data is the foundation for making future decisions. It's through our actions and decisions that we affect the world around us. Businesses and organizations need people like you who can think critically and analytically about how to directly address challenges and opportunities through data-focused projects. The work of data professionals can provide businesses and organizations with details about their practices that can promote new approaches and innovation. This might make a little more sense if we take a closer look at an example a global delivery company, for instance. Generally speaking, delivery companies are responsible for transporting goods to consumers. A company as complex as this is going to have a number of different data inputs or streams that influence, impact, and affect the ways the business operates. These data inputs and streams may include, but are not limited to, weather and traffic patterns, which affect when deliveries are projected to arrive, gas price trends and fuel economy, which affect shipping costs and profit margins, truck loading times in relation to the number of workers available, which affects the time it takes for the delivery to reach its final destination, how users interact with the company's app to track their packages, which affects the customer experience and the company's ratings, and whether users engage with marketing emails sent after they make specific purchases, which impacts future and repeat sales. My point is, each of these variables affects the way organizations harness data to transform decisions, automating and adapting machine learning where applicable. The ability to unlock transformative information within data is a skill that businesses seek. As you progress within this program, you'll discover how data professionals can make meaningful contributions to almost any organization by finding action-oriented solutions within data. All professions require a certain set of tools for success, and data-driven work is no different. In this video, we'll open our analytics toolbox and look at some of the most common items. Before we begin, I want to emphasize that each of the items serves their own individual purpose. However, when used together, they help build and tell stories with data, which can then inform, influence, and impact business decisions. Programming languages are the first tools we'll investigate. They allow data professionals to work efficiently within and dissect large data sets. Most languages have been developed over time, and each data professional has their own preferences. We'll mention two in this video that have become very popular for data analysis, the R programming language and Python. R is a programming language that's used extensively by researchers and academics. It was my primary language during graduate studies in statistics, and some people say that R captures the statistician's mindset. I'd say there's something to that sentiment. 
If you're after implementations of the latest statistical breakthroughs, R is a great place to look. But it's used for more than statistics. You'll find many new technologies and ideas programmed with it. One of the best features of R is that you can create complex statistical models from just a few lines of code. If you're curious about R or need a refresher, be sure to check out our Google Data Analytics Certificate, also offered here on this platform. This program teaches the Python programming language. It's a great choice for a few reasons. First of all, it emphasizes readability, making it one of the easiest programming languages to learn and write. Second, unlike R, Python wasn't born in the data community. While this might sound like a minus, it can also be a huge plus. In the modern world, data is used in increasingly creative ways. So there's a massive advantage to learning a programming language that's capable not only of handling the data side of things, but can also be used to build and deploy the applications that data will be fueling. Although R was my first love, these days I find that I lean more heavily on Python because of its flexibility. Python can perform a wide variety of data-related tasks, which makes it very popular among data professionals. If you're a novice or new to coding completely, Python is a very approachable language. Its formatting is visually uncluttered. It's one of the most beginner-friendly languages, and it has enormous online communities and plenty of resources to help you if you get stuck. We will interact with Python within a web-based computing platform, also called Jupyter Notebooks, which allows you to run code in real time and helps identify errors easily. To visualize the stories in the data, we're going to teach you how to share complex data through a graphical interface. Those who experienced our data analytics program will be familiar with a platform called Tableau. In this program, we'll take a more detailed look at how this powerful tool can help others understand the results of your analysis. Additionally, we'll look at effective communication in data-driven careers. At first glance, it might seem like less of a concern, but describing the sometimes complex processes of data analytics to non-technical stakeholders may be one of the most important skills a data professional can have. Since communication is something we all do regularly, it's easy to forget about the importance of how data professionals share and process data stories. Our goal here is to strengthen the communicative skills that you already possess so that you can leave this program equipped to excel. In this course specifically, and across other segments of this program, communication will be a key component that is directly tied to the work you'll do as a data professional. Programming languages allow data professionals to interact with and interpret data. Visual data tools like Tableau enrich the stories within data with visual elements that bring attention to specific details. But the most important element of any story is the storyteller. That's you. Your prior experiences and knowledge inform your storytelling abilities, and your distinct background is what will set you apart from others in these roles. Regardless of your eventual career path, remaining determined and developing the proper skills is essential to personal and professional transformation. And the tools we're offering you in this program will also help you along the way. I'm thrilled to continue alongside you in your journey. The best is yet to come. I'll see you soon.